Hello, sushi and scuba fans, and welcome back to Dave the Diver. In the last episode, we went ahead and defeated a Kraken. Now, we've got one day till we have this jellyfish party. And I do have a decent amount of jellyfish. I don't really need any more of the spotted, I think, because I don't have enough salt as it is right now. So, salt is a priority I'm looking for. Oh. Uh-oh. Wait. So it was you, one who's been harming the ocean. You even have vomited, you disgusting creature. That wasn't me, that was Dr. Bacon. Wait, that wasn't me, it was... I have no time for your petty excuses. Now that you've been caught by John Watson of Sea Blue, the Guardians of the Sea, you won't be leaving so easily. I'll turn you into fish food. Yeah. Um... Oh my Poseidon, this is all your fault. You did this to the precious sea. You're the one shooting bombs. And all I did is catch a few fish to keep the restaurant running. Why don't you look into the fishing vessel that's responsible for catching thousands of fish, not individual divers like me. Enough blabbing. I'll shut that yapper of yours. Here goes. Great, another boss battle already. I emptied my clip into him. How dare you fight back against me, John Watson, formerly of the Navy SEALs. I thought the Navy SEALs would have trained you to not be such a wuss, but alright. That should serve as an adequate warning. So I'll be... I'll back away for now to protect the environment, but I won't let you go unpunished. You persist in damaging the ocean. We're watching you. What a weirdo. A path is open in the direction of John, Dawson, John Watson's escape. Let's go that way to reach the signal. Uh, you know what? Probably not. As I said, I'm looking for ingredients and stuff right now. That's my key priority. Alright, we got those things. We will head in his direction, because I'm not sure if there's even any other way to go right now. We'll see here. See if this wall goes all the way to the top. Yes, it does. So we have to go down this way. All right. Now that we're through, let's see what we find. Looking for cooking ingredients, sharks, that parrotfish up there, definitely. That's what I'm more interested in.
Darn it. That's a good thing, but that stupid trigger f or Titan trigger fish there really caused me some trouble. Silver bowl, don't really need that. I am gonna need to find oxygen though. Tranquilizer harpoon. Do you prefer these? I'll get these jellyfish. Hoping for some more ingredients here as well. bang into that exactly. This I want. Hopefully it's salt. It is. Perfect. but I like the sleep ability of the other one. More salt, perfect. Alright. 
So that was fairly successful in that area. need that. Didn't really even want him, but... being annoying. And I do have this oxygen right here, so I'm not too concerned about it. Okay, we're heading into the depths. Right, our headlamp turned on, that's perfect. So you get a special kind of light. Uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and change it out for that one. Oh, you're a feisty one, aren't you? Not what I wanted. fish here, so... Oh! Okay, I don't have something to actually open that with. Ah, now I do. Must be a place the two words are blocking away though. Have to pay, I have two words blocking my way. Is there a solution? Hmm. Let's see. Right, the two worms are said to hate UV light and will shrink away from it. You don't have one lying around, do you? Oh, you already have one. Try shining it on them. Alright. see people from before. Yeah, she's dead. Mm. Um, they're saying something. I can't tell what they're saying. I'll have to call Dr. Bacon. My goodness. Wow. To think to see people were real. Simply incredible. Um, they're saying something to me, but I can't understand that. I think analyzing the patterns might allow us to translate. Come back to the boat for now. I think I'll try to th and think of a way to translate. 
All right. Well, if I'm leaving this area, I'm gonna go ahead and get this. Are the two worms gonna be back? Yeah, they are. I do like that the battery recharges on that though, so it's not like I have to just uh, have it on constantly. Let's see about going down this way. I've got an ingredient here. Let it be salt. Miso. Alright, well, I mean, miso is probably not a bad thing. Oh, boy. Um, that looks like a problem. Whoa! That was dangerous. And I'm still not out of the woods yet by any means. I need to be able to get out of here somehow. Oh darn. Tell me there's something here that I can use to get out of here. Or oxygen. It's a gun. Not really what I need right now. Nope. Never mind. Okay, I do actually see oxygen though. Ow. What are you gonna do? Oh! All right, I'm getting brutalized in here. Alright, if I can get him tranked, then I think I can go ahead and swim past easy enough. Alright, let's just get out of this area. Sort of wanting the rubber chicken. Yeah, taking the rubber chicken. I really need to get out of here though. Oh, there's an escape thing right here. Thank goodness. I'm not even going to worry about looking at anything else. That Mega Mouth Shark nearly killed me. <laughs> hmm, I didn't expect to see people to be real, but to think that they're living sea people. This is truly the find of the century. This is thanks to you, Dave. All right, that works out nicely. Mission completed. Point deep. Ha ha ha! Let's tell all the news outlets in the world about this. Wait, I think that might be risky. But why? That's how we'll get people flocking to this place. It wouldn't matter if we we're talking about some ruins, but these are living sea people. Poachers are bound to show up. They'll start hunting the sea people, since that will be a way to get a lot of attention. You have a point there. 
How about we first make a translator to analyze their sound waves and figure out what they're saying? I think they have something to tell us. First, we need to see people's stone tablet with the writing on it, as well as a microphone and an amethyst. If I'm guessing right, the microphone should be below the sunken ship, and the stone tablet is likely to be in their record chamber. I can hear you. I hear you can mine amethyst at 100 meters or deeper with a pickaxe. Mm -hmm. um, the record chamber, the ship, uh, and. Haha. Uh, 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 I can't remember the locations. Check the to do app. I'll add the information there. Great! Alright, so we got a Mega Mouth Shark. That makes me happy. We got a white tip shark head as well. That's a good thing. We got the Fang Tooth. Three Tooth Puffer. Pacific Fan Fish. Mega Mouth Shark Meat. Comb Jelly. So we got a bunch of different things there. Perfect. Very happy about that. Yowie. You seem energetic today. I saw a bar boss card acquisition notification pop up on your marine card account. It's a giant squid boss card. How did you get this? Such a rare card. Um, well, I was just on my way to pick up a delivery, and as chance would have it. Okay, I don't have a clue what that means, but in any case, you've made amazing progress. Try collecting all the rare boss cards. Something's good sure to happen. Oh, and if you venture into new regions, for example the depths, the automatic marine card AI system will unlock the new card pack. Don't forget to collect fish cards in the new region as well. Choo -choo. Goodbye then, Choo Choo. Alrighty. Still don't understand his whole thing at all. Wait, can I have a moment with you? Yes, I'm sorry, you are? <laughs> I should introduce myself first. I'm a reporter for the magazine Weekly Fish. The name is Udo. Okay. Oh, I've read that magazine too. It covers unique fish species. <gasps> oh, you have. That's right. Yeah. I heard that the Blue Hole is home to a variety of fish species. Is that true? Mm. You could say that. There are all kinds of fish species from around the world. Mm. Oh, I knew it. So I've come to the right place. Yeah. I'd love to take pictures myself for the magazine, but <sighs> unfortunately, I can't dive. Oh. Speaking of which, would you help me take some pictures? Ooh. Pictures? Ooh. You see, you have that nice camera over there. Yeah. Oh, it's the one from Dr. Bacon. Ooh. But I'm no expert in photography. I'm not sure I'm good enough. <laughs> Don't worry. If you're a reader of Weekly Fish, you will get a feel for what kind of fish to photograph. Ooh. And of course, I'll reward you if you take a nice picture. Uh -huh. Well, if you say so. <laughs> Alright, be nice to make a record of this amazing world. <laughs> Okay. Alright, so we already got the amethyst. I mined that, so that's great. So we need the microphone and the stone tablet. First thing, though, is I want to go to the sushi bar and see about those tires that I were blind to do. I'm really wanting a new hire. Hiring is in progress, though. Alright, that's annoying. That says... So give it some time until tomorrow. I guess so. Let's see what we got here. So we've got Mega Mouth Sart Shark Sushi. That could be enhanced nicely. I probably will do that. Then we've got three uh, Tooth Puffer Sushi, Pacific Fan Fish Sushi, and Fang Tooth Sushi. Yeah, that's not a huge one to do there. Comb Jellyfish. There we go. That's another one here on the list. Alright. Not going to do any of those right now. Let's go back to the boat. Got an air dive before we get to the dinner menu. sort of want this harpoon gun. You know what? I'm gonna go for it. Oh, it looks like a shark. Yeah, I'm definitely going for it. 
That way I should be able to get things better with my harpoon gun, because really, it does more damage than my gun does, so... Especially when dealing with things like the Mega Mouth, I want that extra damage. Shock harpoon. Please be salt. <coughs> Common cat food? <coughs> Should I give it to Momo? Okay, that's different. Um, alright. Well, we'll give it to Momo, I guess. I've been petting the cat, but I guess I'll feed the cat too. Why not? enough of those for the jellyfish party. I really don't want any more of them. And of course I see plenty more of them. <laughs> no, don't want that. I didn't want that little guy. I'll throw him away if I need to. Gun enhancement's always a good thing. I get damaged by that guy. Soy sauce. Shark Harpoon will take care of you. <laughs> Speaking of sharks...
go. Oh, what a strange coral. Huh. All right. He yanked me. Then he laughed at me. Ah, that octopus it sprayed me with ink. Just wait till I catch him. Here I come. Finally caught you. You stay right. Okay. Oh no, it escaped through a door crack. Um, I don't think I can fit in there. Come to think of it, I probably could use the gas cutter from Duff to cut my way in. Just you wait, octopus. Alright. I'm like, I was pressing the button, it was not cutting right away. That was good. Good enough. Yeah, let's go to the new region. Mm. You, you got nowhere to run now. Give up. Mm. I guess I'll have octopus sashimi for dinner. Aww. Well, not having it anyways. Escaped again. It's so quick. Oh, listen. Huh, it dropped something. Rusty octopus bracelet. Seems to be an artifact. I'll have to identify it back at the surface. Alright. Might as well get this oxygen while I'm in here. Perfect. Yep. Stripe. Mackerel scat. Alright. So these are some different fish I hadn't seen before. And we got the cuttlefish. I'm just not gonna mess around with the uh, currents there. I just don't feel like it. Especially when I can get a couple cuttlefish right here. Oh. There we go. starting to fill up on things that I probably don't need. I've got quite a few of them right now. Okay, here's the records room. Let's go to the records room, get that uh, glyph. Alright. Stone tablet. There we go. Please don't be able to have it. Impossible to read. <laughs> I just need an intercom microphone to create the Sea Evil Translator.
Not what I wanted, really. We'll get the sesame oil, though, because, I mean, that's a good thing. Don't really want the tr the sawtooth shark if I can help. I'm actually more interested in going into the deep if I can. Let's go ahead and get this oxygen here. Sand. I don't like you. Yeah, we'll get that UV light just in case we need it. Opa. Okay. Looks like a sunfish. This is the first time I've seen one of these. Hey, I'll take the picture as a souvenir. Alright. Capture two Opas at once. Now let's retake. Got the optional. Perfect. Yeah, I think that's the Mega Mouth over there. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, let's discard this, 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 this. I want to be full speed. Nasty looking crab down there. But he's slow moving, so I'm not going to worry about him too much. Sensor bomb trap. Oh, I would love that ingredient, but crab is right on top of it. I don't know how deep I can go. Oh, that didn't work. But like one of these guys.
Yeah, it doesn't seem like I can capture those. Oh, alright. What are you? Not very aggressive is what you are. What do I have that I can get rid of? My trigger fish definitely can get rid of. My trigger fish. Giant barracuda, giant barracuda. Now in dredge, that would have been called a ghost shark. Found rhino cremide? Interesting. the rubber chicken. Also gonna shoot this tiny fish. Evidently I'm not gonna shoot this tiny fish. Got the sea toad. And we got salt. I always love getting salt. Don't think there's anywhere to go over here. It's just a brick wall, it looks like. That's why I'm liking these deep sea areas. They're sort of neat. I don't mind getting the new stuff here. I don't know what to do with those crabs yet. That's something I'm going to have to figure out. But alright, I think I'm leaving this area. I might as well use this oxygen, top myself off. launcher oh I gotta try this out <laughs> sea snake whip live living sea snake whip. nope I'm not taking it I don't want a sea snake whip <laughs> have no interest in that whatsoever all right there's an escape place right there for us you know we might as well see about Mine in this. Actually, you know what? No. I gotta feed my chicken. I'm just here to explore right now. Really, if anything, that dinosaur. Oh, there is something I'm more interested in.
They're sort of heavy. Look, cuttlefish are also sort of heavy. Cuttlefish I can get anytime I really want. dangerous than anything I'd say. Dangerous to my health as well as anything else. I just wanted to go up here and see what's up here. Oh. Uh, you know what? Actually, let's go ahead and drop two of those so we can pick that one up because the jellyfish for the jellyfish party you'll be better and these guys I can't seem to catch all right well we've explored decently I'm gonna go ahead and take that escape pod get out of this area I do love the chicken though <laughs> I'd say that was a very successful dive for us. Time to go to the sushi restaurant. And prepare for dinner. Yeah, that was our longest time and it was our deepest depth. Bracelet found a corner while chasing down a nasty octopus. Dash a short distance. Nah, I don't like that as much as the other ones I got for right now. <gasps> Udo. Oh, you brought a picture of something. Can I see? <laughs> oh, an opa. Did you know that the opa is warm-blooded? Mm. Oh, I think I've heard about it. Uh -huh. It's amazing that some fish species are warm-blooded. The ocean is full of mysteries. <laughs> I'll put your picture to good use. I'm sure the readers will love it. Hey, 200 extra. Uh, there are photo spots all over the place. Thank you for your help and keep up the good work. <laughs> Sounds good. Boncho. <laughs> uh, Dave, are you busy? <laughs> Not at the moment. What is it? <laughs> we have a strange customer at the sushi bar. <laughs> Can you come over for a moment? <laughs> As a manager, this is something I can't overlook. I'll come over right away. Okay. Ooh. Very happy about the people we got here. I'm going to go hire some people. <laughs> Alright. First, let's go to this. I want Raptor for without a question, but I also am going to take Itsuki. So we're going to take Itsuki, very cheap, but the thing is, if you look at the details here, her appeal is quite good, which means I'm going to actually use her as a, uh, in the long run, she's going to become a manager possibly for me. So without a question, we're going to hire her. Let's get her on board. And let's go ahead and put her in place of Kyoko for right uh, You know what? Let's put her in place of Davina. We'll swap Itsuki in. Then we'll go to the waiting room, have her dispatch her to get more salt. 
because she's very good at that and she should be able to get us some more salt. Yes, get us that salt, please. Thank you. That way we should have the salt for the party. All right, then her, I want to train her. Don't know if I can train her enough to make it really good. Yes, I can. That's exactly what I wanted. So now she will serve drinks, which is actually incredibly helpful to me. Uh, it'll take a lot of the burden off my plate. <laughs> so, perfect. Can I train her again? No, can't really train her again for right now, but that's fine. We are going to get Raptor as well here in a few moments. Alright. Huh. Who dares interrupt me? I'm sorry, we're not open yet. You can't come in like this. Well, aren't you strict? I was simply saying a few words. I haven't been to the beach in a while and it brings back old memories. I was an amazing diver before I took a harpoon in the knee. So you were a diver? I'm also a diver. <laughs> then you must know the diver's dream of swimming in all the seas of the world. Forests of coral, odds of sperm whales, fights to the death with tiger sharks. Mm. That brings to mind a dish I'd really love to eat. What dish do you mean? Mm. When I was little, the moray eel curry at my fishing village was famous. Mm. I can't forget its taste. Uh, if you could make that dish, perhaps, I'll give you a nice gift. Hmm, <laughs> mm. moray eel. Mm. Moray eel hides in the rocks, making them difficult to catch. How do you get one? <laughs> you know how to dive, but you don't know much of the ecology, do you? Uh. Moray eels are nocturnal and only come out at night. <laughs> do you have gear for night diving? <laughs> oh. I did get a flashlight recently. That should be just fine. <laughs> Mori eels are nocturnal. Please go night diving and catch Mori eel to fulfill my wish. Mm. Hmm. I haven't gone diving at night for a while. Maybe I will try it. You can dive once every night. There are many vicious nocturnal fish out at night, but you also see exotic fish. Always pay attention to the sushi bar's opening hours. I guess I'll go night diving? Fine. We'll go to the boat. We'll try night diving. Uh, eco watcher? No. No, not what I was wanting. Rinka. Is there a way to see... I really would love to know how deep the moray eel is. So I'm going to consume one third of my working hours doing this dive, so I better find a moray eel with it. It's going to make this episode also a bit long, but you know what? That's fine. Definitely don't need kelp or anything like that. We got a gun upgrade, so that's a good thing. Ooh. Okay, this is actually very problematic here. Everything is out to get me, basically. Alright. Box jellyfish. Sleepy toy hammer. Is that a reef shark? I think it is. Okay, you are taking a lot more shots than you did before. But I'll still kill you. So they're a bit tougher at night, maybe? I don't know. 
don't need the O2 yet. It's good to have it there. Got this sleepy time hammer, which I'm guessing means it will put things to sleep. Yeah, we'll go with the poison harpoon, that's fine. As I said, I have no idea where a more eel would be. Which is a little bit of a problem. Okay, it does work, but... Oh, that's a problem. Alright. It put him to sleep. I'm gonna need this oxygen over here, and need to get rid of this hammer, too, because the hammer's terrible. <laughs> I guess it would be okay on maybe box jellyfish or something though, so that could be a good thing. be a good dive since I'm using a third of my night up here with it. Barracuda is not that great for me. I think these are sort of important at this point. So let's go ahead and pick that up. seem tougher at night because a barracuda I could have easily taken during the day. Yeah, don't care to go over that way really if I don't have to. I've got oxygen over here so I like being somewhat close to it in case I were to need it. We've got this open space here so there could be something nice here. Oh, I do need some ammo. Our Barracuda. I guess I'll take it. I mean, I'm not out of space yet. Ah, there's ammo. Perfect. of barracudas. Which I guess works fine. Oh boy. spot right here and we do need to be aware of it because we do not have any other oxygens with us.
Really? Oxygen over here. We'll go ahead and grab this. Grab this. Just see if there's anything worthwhile over here. Doesn't look like I can actually go into the deep right now. Fine, I'll take the silver bowl. escape pod at here? Yeah, there it is. Alright, so we got him as more eel. And we got some nice animals out of it, so I'm pretty pleased with that. Get back to the restaurant. We'll go ahead and serve the more eel. So let's make the menu here. Wow, that's nice. Of you. We'll go ahead and enhance that. Toad sushi. I mean, that's pretty good just for what it is. Box jellyfish sushi. More eight eel sushi. So we'll go ahead and serve this. You know what? Let's go ahead and enhance it once. Then we'll go ahead and serve it. And we'll auto supply it. Then this one we can now enhance. Then we'll go ahead and serve it. This one we'll go ahead and serve. And we'll auto supply. Tiger Shark Sushi. We'll go ahead and just serve and auto supply. Mega Mouth Sushi. Let's go ahead and enhance it. Then we'll go ahead and auto supply it. Long no shark. We can definitely enhance it. And then we'll go ahead and auto supply it as well. Three tooth puffer. You know what? We'll just do one of those and auto supply it. So we've got a very nice menu overall here. Tons of stuff on it, tons of flavors. Really impressive, I think. All right, let's go ahead and open Bancho Sushi. So now we have a waitress who can pour drinks and that's what she's doing right over there. Oh, he wants a different meal. <laughs> what I need to do for him. Oh, I need 
turmeric. But I don't have enough more yeal now because I served it instead. Oh, that's unfortunate. That was my own fault. Alright. Well, we'll go ahead and uh, pour this beer. He's just gonna have to wait for another night. Because I'm gonna have to get more more yield. Very unfortunate. Jellyfish party is tonight. Perfect. Alright. Shiny deep sea fish sushi. Can't get it anywhere else. All plump and oily. Wow, it looks delicious. At Bancho Sushi, we use only the highest quality wasabi. Alright, so we're doing well on those things. We still have to get the best taste up, and we gotta get more followers. And we gotta research some more recipes as well. Alright. 12,047. 1,247. Let's see if we have enough. I don't think we're quite there where we can buy Raptor yet. That's sort of annoying to me. Oh yeah, we can buy Raptor. Alright. So let's hire him. Then we're going to go ahead and replace her with him. Then let's go to the waiting room and send her out for... We already got turmeric. We only have one of each of these. Let's go ahead and send her out for miso. Alright. So they're both out doing their thing. Now we have Raptor here. Don't think I can train him yet. Nope, need a little bit more money before I can train him. But he's going to definitely be one of our servers. He's long-term going to be our server. The other one isn't going to be long-term, but she is good to have. Oh, and I almost forgot. Before we do anything else, before we leave for this episode, let's go ahead and feed Momo. Aww. <laughs> Momo's happy. Nice. I'm staring at you. Alright. Well, that works out nice. I am going to have to get more moray eels. I can't believe I screwed that up. So, let's go ahead and... We will have to do that on another day, though, because I'm not going to do that during the jellyfish party day. Um... What I'm going to do is, next episode, I'm going to check which jellyfish or anything that I need and go ahead and try to catch those so that I have more for the party. But with that in mind, I hope you enjoyed what we did in this episode. If you did, please go ahead and click that like button. If you've not already, please subscribe to the channel, click the bell icon, so they're aware when I produce new videos in the future. Thank you, and I hope to see you again for more Dave the Diver.